Welcome to our Knows Your Wine video series. These videos aim to provide you, the wine waitering staff, with basic wine knowledge and service tips. We hope to give you a better understanding of wine, thus improving the guest experience, enabling you to upsell and thereby increasing your earning potential. Thank you. I want the Simonsich Pinotage, please. Looks good. Simonsich Pinotage, yeah, that's the 2011. Yeah. yeah, perfect. We'll bring it shortly, sir. Thank you. Hello wine service professionals. So you've taken the order, you've written down exactly what the guest has asked for, go straight to the point of sale system, punch it in, go to the bar, collect the wine, and let's get that wine into the glasses as soon as possible. Mr. Carson, may I present the Simonsa 2011 Pinotage? Perfect, thanks. So once Mr. Carson has agreed and this is what he has ordered, we take a step back, we make sure we open the wine in front of the table so that the guests can build the trust and actually know that when we pour the wine inside, it is what they've ordered. So you cut the foil traditionally, you cut it at the bottom of the lip itself, or you can cut it at the top, it's really truly up to you and your service standards in your establishment. You take this foil guy and just put it into your apron, you don't put it on the table, you make sure you, you hide it away because I don't think that's something that the guests will want to approve. You take the screw part of your cork and make sure you put it right into the center of the cork. As you can see, it's going right all the way. At every single stage, just make sure you are at least showing the guests what the, the label is. It just looks more tidier. Using the first lever of your double lever opener, slowly pull out the cork. Wiggle it out a little bit. And then straight away, you need to give this cork back to Mr. Carson so that he can look at the quality of it and be sure that it doesn't have any fault. Mr. Carson, if you would like to approve that for us. Mm, smells nice. If you have a screw cap, just put it straight into your apron. Don't present it to the guest as you would present the cork. It's always very important to pour a very small tasting portion for your guests such that they can approve and make sure that what they order is what's inside. Mr. Carson's, if you will give us the go ahead, sir. That smells nice. Mm, that's a good recommendation. Okay. Thank you. Now that Mr. Carson's is happy and has given us the go ahead, it's very important we pour some wine for the rest of the guests so that they can also feel the joy that uh, our guests has experienced. So, what did we share in this video? Collect the wine from storage, present the wine showing the name, vintage, farm, grape variety and hold a bottle at the base. Take a step back and open at the table. If a cork closure, put the corkscrew in the centre of the cork, turn and pull out the cork. Present the cork to the host. If a screw cap, turn the cap, remove it and place in your apron. 